What's up guys, Sam here, welcome to Tech Today TV. We already reported on the upcoming Samsung Galaxy S23 FE Fan Edition smartphone. Now, however, the anticipation of some fans should be curbed. The mobile device has already been spotted on Geekbench, with the Exynos 2200 as the SoC. So far, there is no evidence of an alternative version with a Snapdragon chip. According to this leaked render image, the exterior is based on the Galaxy S23 series or the Galaxy A54. The edges of the display were also discussed on Twitter. All previously release Galaxy S23 models use a modified version of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2. That could change with the fan edition, perhaps to save costs. Samsung could use an older processor from Qualcomm for this version. Twitter user Orisdoc claims that the manufacturer will include the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 processor. Recently, there have also been reports that Samsung may be using the Exynos 2200 from the Galaxy S22 in the Fae model. Whatever processor it will be that the Galaxy S23 FE turns out to be the device tested in this benchmark, it is considered unlikely. Compared to the last fan edition, Samsung should pay attention to the camera. The Galaxy S23 could have a 4,500 mAh battery. The cell phone supports fast charging at 25 watts. Also, there are probably blue stickers on the battery that are supposed to be pull tabs, with which the battery replacement could be simplified. Rumors circulating on the net report that the smartphone should be equipped with the excellent AMOLED panel of the S23, a screen that benefits from a refresh rate of 120 Hz and very high brightness. According to information relayed by SmartPrix, the screen of the S23 FE would benefit from a surface of 6.4 inches. Moreover, the same source mentions 6 or 8 GB of RAM, a storage capacity of 128 or 256 GB. Leaker Revegnus shared, in a recent tweet, some specs of the S23 FE. This publication tells us more about the photographic equipment that the smartphone will have. The phone is expected to feature a triple rear camera, consisting of a 50MP wide-angle lens, a 12MP ultra-wide-angle module, and an 8MP telephoto lens. The next fan edition will also feature a 12-megapixel front camera. Samsung should soon fix the focus issue that plagues the Galaxy S23 and S23+. Plus. The Galaxy S23 FE will therefore most likely benefit from the same preferential treatment. The Samsung Galaxy S23 FE runs One UI 5.1, is based on Android 13 and packs 256 GB of inbuilt storage. The Samsung Galaxy S23 FE is tipped to be a dual SIM mobile that will accept nano SIM and nano SIM cards. It features an IP68 rating for dust and water protection. Share your thoughts and comments below. I hope you found our content interesting, and if you did, please like and hit the subscribe button. See you in the next video.